Hi there, and welcome to this video tutorial about DOST, SEI Undergraduate Scholarship Program Application. Today, I will teach you about the step-by-step -step tutorial on the application process. Make sure to continue watching this video till the end to know the step-by-step -step process. But before proceeding to this video, let's try to know more about the scholarship. Now, what is the DOST scholarship about? The SNT Undergraduate Scholarships Program aims to stimulate and entice talented Filipino youths to pursue lifetime productive careers in science and technology and ensure a steady, adequate supply of qualified science and technology human resources, which can steer the country towards national progress. There are two types of scholarship programs. First, is the Republic Act No. 7687, also known as the Science and Technology Scholarship Act of 1994, which provides for scholarships to talented and deserving students whose family's socioeconomic status do not exceed the set cutoff values of certain indicators. Second is the, the DOST, SEI Merit Scholarship Program, which is awarded to students with high aptitude in science and mathematics, and are willing to pursue careers in the fields of science and technology. Here are some of the DOST list of priority programs and courses. You can also visit the DOST website for more information and details. Here are the list of scholarship privileges, which includes a tuition and other school fees of 40,000 pesos a year, a monthly living allowance of 7,000 per month, and many more. Among the general qualifications includes being natural-born Filipino citizen, a resident of the municipality as attested by the barangay, of good moral character and in good health, and a qualifier of the S&T scholarship examination. To start your application, visit the link provided below. The application process consists of four steps. We have the registration, the eligibility check, the filling out of the application form, and uploading the documentary requirements. And lastly, the selection of the testing centers. To register, you will be asked to input your complete name, email and birth date. Once you click register, a confirmation message will be sent to your email address. Just click the link provided in your email. Once you click the link, a verification will pop up on your screen, which asks you to input your birth date. Read carefully and answer truthfully the questions that follows then click Submit. If you think there is a need to review your answers, you can review them. If you're ready, you may click the Continue button to proceed. Once you click the Submit button, you will be given your application ID. Then you may click the Proceed to Application Form button to continue. Up next is the Personal Data tab. Once you are done filling out the necessary information, just click the Save button to continue. Up next is the Contact Information tab, followed by the Family Information tab. Then we have the Contact Information and the Household Information Questionnaire tab. Next, is the School Information. Then, you will be asked to check the appropriate circle for the scholarship program that you applied for. Finally is the last stage where you will be asked to upload the necessary required supporting documents. We have the scholarship form, the certificate of good moral character, certification of good health, the principal certification for applicant from the STEM strand, the certificate of residency, your recent one by one picture, birth certificate, and lastly the parents proof of employment. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe Makerspace Wisdom YouTube channel.